Hello, everybody. This is Harley Barley back again with another episode of Long Live the Queen. When we last left off, our father decided he was going to be a lumen at the last minute and fight Togami in our place because we lost our naval battle because we didn't have climbing skills up that high. So, unfortunately, our father is dead. So, anyway, Togami's decided to leave. Nobody's gonna fight him, so here we go. Pity. And she's very, 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 very depressed right now. Which is understandable considering what she just went through. Well, let's go ahead and we may as well do some elegance. You practice standing up, sitting down, and bending and picking up items from the floor. Bend at the knees, not at the waist. You practice speaking and laughing quietly. Not trying to disappear or go unheard, but focusing your energy into a smaller space so that it draws people closer. You practice sitting quietly and listening to the conversations of others without becoming bored or restless. You practice standing in attractive positions in full costume and maintaining those poses for long periods of time. The war has ended and the Sanjians have withdrawn. All throughout Nova, a fragile layer of calm lies over a deeper pit of uncertainty and fear. Your court musician has already con contracted? Contracted. Constructed, I think they meant. An epic ballad about your father's last moments. His nobility, his love, his brave sacrifice. His praises are sung in every village square. Rich merchants foresee a great trade in artwork commemorating both of your parents. That doesn't make them any less dead. And she's back to willful. So, she's, she's able to move on decently enough for her people's sake. So, let's see. All of that's really high. Um... Well, let's see, we may as well do a ciphering and then something else, I guess, just to bump our stuff up. That's intrigue, isn't it? Okay, ciphering and then internal affairs. Locked a new outfit, woo! Visitors have arrived to see you. Your family are what remains of it. Oh! It's our auntie. My poor darling Elodie, you should not be alone at a time like this. There is still so much to be done, and you so young. We have come to give you whatever help we can. Thank you. She's right, after all. You have a coronation to plan, a domain to run, and without your father, you need some adult to give you advice. So, let's do uh, a small feast. Let's visit Charlotte. Lodi, I'm sorry about your dad. Why? Why does it always have to be something like this before we get to see each other? I'm sorry. For a while, all you can do is cling to your cross and then cry. At least you are not alone. Well, at least we have a new outfit. I think that's good, right? But it doesn't really do much for us, unfortunately. Um, well, we may as well keep going. Okay. Don't listen to all those fools pressuring you to choose one noble or another. Not at the time like this. Have they no decency? You deserve time to mourn. Dear niece, it would break my heart to see my own daughter in such a situation. Both of you are still so young. Remember poor Kayla? The past Duchess of Elath? Her father forced her into a marriage to get an heir for the duchy. And for that, she died in childbirth while she was only seventeen. At your age, it is neither wise nor safe to wed. You're probably right. There's no need to hurry. 
At least our auntie has our back. So part of our army scattered. And our mood's angry, but at least it's something. And it boosts this stuff. Okay, so internal affairs and for intelligence. And we made it to Queen because of our father's sacrifice. <laughs> Long live the queen! Long live the queen! So yay! I didn't actually have to cheat for us to win, but... Okay. What? Wait. This doesn't make sense. After the coronation in a private ceremony with the High Priestess, Elodie was officially offered her mother's Lumen Crystal. How could she... How could she get the lumen crystal? I thought Togami took it. Did, did I miss something there? Or... Okay. She refused to accept it. For the first time in centuries, magic would have no hold on the throne of Nova. The tragic events of the past year left a gap in the Novan power structure. Since Jocelyn, Duke of Kalori, died with no acknowledged heir to his title. Elodie, of course, was the reigning queen, which by tradition would prevent her from holding the duchy as well. In order to resolve the situation quickly, and to keep lands within her family, Aldi offered the grand control of Kalori to her uncle Laurent, the current Duke of Merva. The title of Merva, in the meantime, will be transferred to her Aunt Lucille, who had always claimed to be descended from the extinct Mervyn line. It would then be up to the couple which of their children inherited which territories. So, they were with us in the end, and were helping us after our father passed away, so... You know, it, it's nice that Elodie remembered them when the time came. During Elodie's reign, the public opinion of ma lumens and magic in general would fall to a new low. Parents thought that their children, that lumen power, was all tied up with witchcraft and blood sacrifice, and would always lead to sorrow in the end. In some territories, any village outcast found to be in possession of a shiny bit of rock was likely to fall victim to a lynch mob, and the miscreants were rarely punished. Better safe than sorry when it came to magic, after all. Even healers and priestesses were eyed with some suspicion. Who knows what cost their powers might have. So, yeah, that's... Since LD wasn't a powerful loom, and then this happened. Please ignore the cat in the background. I am sorry for that. The cat likes to talk when I'm recording. The young queen sponsored expeditions of trained knights to venture into the old forest and attempt to exterminate the monsters within. Unfortunately, black magic would not give up its grip on Nova so easily. Many lives were lost, and with their blood, the monsters appeared to grow even stronger. True to his word, Togami and the Sanjians ignored Nova in the years to come focusing their efforts instead on the far northern continent of Borealis. What he sought there, Elodie did not know, but she suspected it might someday have grave consequences for Nova. Elodie eventually married a foreign duke in order to advance allies and promote Novan strength. It was not a love match, but the two parties learned to respect and care for each other. They raised two children, a son and a daughter. The young Elodie always had a way with words, and that would serve her well. The true battleground of any war is the hearts and minds of the people, and thus Elodie's legacy stretched into the future. All right, so it looks like we made it to Queen without me having to cheat that time around, but in order to actually possibly win this time around, let's load up Let's see which... Nope. Um, might take a moment. Nope, nope, nope. I don't want... I want to load. Okay. So, what I'm going to do is... Let's see what our skills are right now. Yeah, okay. Awesome. 
So I'm going to show you guys how to open the cheat menu. We're going to go to menu. We're going to go to preferences. And let's see. How do I do this again? Uh, let's see. Let's see. Um, what? I think it was around here. Video settings. Debugging console. There it is. All right. So in order for you guys to do skill changes, which is what I'm going to show you, you're going to type in the skill underscore the name equals X. X being between 0 and 100. So, for instance, public speaking the 75 would be public underscore speaking equals 75. The only difference is, uh, I think voice is a little bit different. Uh, let me check. Um, yeah, voice underscore skill. So, that's the only one that's different. So, for us, we are going to do running equals 100 climbing equals 100 swimming e equals 100 done all right um huh i wonder why it didn't do anything Oh, right. We needed an underscore after those. My bad. My bad. Okay, so let's try this again. Running underscore equals 100. Swimming underscore. Nope. I kept it in the wrong one. Equals 100. Climbing. I can't spell. Nothing. Okay, so uh, let's try just going on to our classes and see what we can do from there. So, uh, strategy, more strategy. I'm gonna recruit soldiers. Direct the fleet. All right, now let's take a look at our skills. Yay, running, climbing, swimming, all that sky high. So, let's see what else we need. I'm gonna think that's it. So, um, let's go ahead and just do some reflexes while we're at it. Athletics, athletic, no, nope, it's agility, that's reflexes. And, yay, climbing is a success. You clamber up the rigging to take positions. Uh, nope. Ah, what have we done wrong? Um, so that didn't work, so let's go back to our, nope. Let's go back to load game with that. And let's try preferences again. And we'll try adding in a bunch of lassie so we can recruit soldiers. So in order to do that one, you're going to do lassie equals something. So I'm just going to go for the full thing right there. Uh, and then we'll do our skills again the way I want them. Running. Climbing. I'll do reflexes too. And I don't know if this will work, but war equals 100. So, enter. Done. Don't know if that's going to help us, but uh, we're going to try anyway, so. Yeah, let's do composure, I think. Yeah, composure and... Um, well, let's, while we're at it, let's just max out some more stuff. So, nope, nope, I hit credits. I hit credits by mistake. 
Bah. Okay, so Novin, our score history. Doop 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 Oh, world history. Not just world. And we may as well bump up our internal fares and all that jazz. And we'll just hope that this works. So usually on our next turn it switches over. So for skills... Um... Let's go ahead and do reflexes. Or wait, nope, I already maxed that one out, didn't I? That's gonna be maxed out. Um, oh, we can't do any of that, so... Let's see... Decoration? We'll do decoration? We'll do decoration. Recruit soldiers. No, 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 no. I, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to stay in. This is this is not working out the way I wanted it to work out. I am just messing up. Ah. Uh, no, 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 no. Wrong game. Wrong game. Yes. Okay, so. For this one, we're just going to do climbing. Hundred. Um, what, what else do we need for that? Um, Lassie equals. Uh, da, 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 da. You know, what? we'll just go from there. We'll we'll ho we'll hope this works. So. Uh, strategy and strategy, and we'll keep going. Recruit soldiers. Direct the fleet. We have 11 battalions and 2 platoons. Okay, so, um... Let's keep going, I guess. So, with some foreign intelligence... Wait, I think we have an outfit for that, don't we? No, no we don't. No, stop that. Foreign intelligence. Ah. Uh, so that didn't work. Um, hmm. Oh well. It looks like that didn't help us out much, if any, at all. So, ah uh, well. I guess I'm just gonna end this video here. Yeah, because that didn't help us at all. Except his terms. Obey, attack him. Well, we didn't choose obey last time, so we'll do that. Swallowing your pride, you kneel and press your lips to the back of his cold fingers. Good girl. Yeah. Kind of want to hit him in the face. I just want to smack him a few times. Just smack, smack. Well, we'll just... Well, I guess we can do an extravagant face that time. Eh, well. I don't think this is going to change anything, really, so... Well, at least we did make it to be a warrior queen, even if it 
cost our father his life, so... There has got to be some other way for us to beat that fleet. And we will find out in another video. As for now, thank you all for tuning in with me and helping me make Elodie into a warrior queen. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can find more videos just like this as soon as they come out. Thank you guys so much. This is Harley Barley, signing out.